What's up, Rare Moment fam? Happy Saturday. Welcome back to the show. I am AG. This is Cole. We are the Rare Moment. Today, we are back with an NFL all-day pack opening video. Uh, we are recording this on Friday, getting it out on Saturday. So as you guys are watching this, yesterday they dropped two packs, a standard pack at $49 and a premium pack at $249. Each of us just got into the standard pack. That was our risk tolerance for the day. We did not want to spend anything more looking at who was in the packs. If you guys enjoy these pack opening videos, smash that like button right now. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow us on Twitter at The Rare Moment. When you're on the go, find us on Spotify. Comment section down below, guys. Let us know how you're feeling about these packs. Let us know if you, you got into them, you got a premium, you got into the standard. Let us know if you pulled any legendaries, any rares. Let us know who you guys pulled. We can have some discussions about it. With all that being said here, Cole, I'm going to toss it over to you right now. Let's head over to Evaluate Market before we get into it real quick. And uh, let's see what NFL All Day is looking like. Yeah, before we really get into it, like you mentioned, we each got ourselves a standard pack today or yesterday. Didn't go for the premium pack, just a little too expensive for our liking, a little too much risk there, which is unfortunate because, you know, the first pack drop after yeah. the marketplace being open and we're already worried about losing money. I hate that with 100%. Uh, just that shouldn't be happening for the first drop after a marketplace opening up for any platform. So that's very disappointing. But looking at the bright side, this is a very, very good opportunity to do some buying on the marketplace. We both genuinely believe. Yeah, and we've already we've, we've been buyers so far. Yeah, we've already been doing some buying and probably going to do some more buying here in the next few days in the coming week. So oh, yeah. with that being said, heading over to Evaluate Market, as you can see, the number of NFTs we got a little over 2.4 mil floor price of about five dollars for some moments right now. Uh, over 600,000 in total sales today, over 13,000 mm -hmm. transactions. And as you can see, this number right here, we got about 70,890 collectors. So we're getting increasing every single day, every single week. And we are rapidly approaching that number of 100,000. Yeah, we're not even out of closed beta yet. So, yep. So moving on to the pack opening here. Let's go, the baby. First ever packs that were released on NFL all day, or at least the the first week they had yeah. packs. So yeah, this is a, a flashback here of week 13 packs. So we're going to open this and we're going to see what yeah, we got. A lot of opportunity for NFL all day debuts here. I'm going to see here. Do we have any rares? Door number two is not a rare. No rare there. No okay. Rare. So we don't have any rares here, but there's still some good players we could pull. Yeah. Russell Wilson, Aaron Donald, Chase Claypool, Metcalf. There's a lot of good players in this in this Open arena. Open for here. a good serial here. Come on. Door number one. What do we got? 7872. Pierre Desir. So I believe he's probably going for about five, six bucks on the yep. market. I know I've seen him yeah. down at the floor. So disappointing yeah. first pull, but Whoa. hopefully the next two clean it up here. Exactly. Nice we, we, we both knew that, you know, we're probably pulling one to two, six, seven dollar moments. Hopefully we get a player like Russell Wilson that can uh, bring us back into a more even situation yeah. here. Just disgusting play altogether. The the yeah. Buccaneers and Falcons. Ugh. Yeah. Only thing that would make it worse for me is the Buccaneers and Saints. <laughs> but all, all right, right. So Pierre this year. Let's go door number three. I got a good feeling about door number two. What do we got here? Seven, three, four, four. Foster, Foster Moreau. Moreau. So I think again, he's probably he's in that lower that floor yeah. right now. Eight, nine, probably bucks. six. Yeah, yeah six, maybe seven, seven bucks. bucks. Nice play. I know yeah. we've played him in some uh, DraftKings lineups before. Oh yeah, he took some darts on Foster Moreau. Oh yeah, I mean, it never pays off when we play him though. Yeah, I mean, uh, what you guys got going? What you got going on here so far is the NFL All Day debuts for these guys. So yeah. you got that rolling. Which is here. just. It's just nuts that these are still going for five, you know what, six bucks. and that's all right. That's we, we yeah, can't look, it, we great look buying at that. opportunity. Yeah, we don't look great at that right now because we know Top Shot's adding utility in the future. So, all right, here we go. I got a good feeling about this one. Come on, what Door do we got? Two? Low cereal, nine six five six. Ashton awesome Doolin. Okay, Doolin. so the worst again, case scenario here. Almost. Yeah, I don't want to be too negative in this, but this is. 
probably what a worst case scenario looked like. This was my fear going into <laughs> yeah. this pack opening. Yeah. So, you know, this is probably going to scare me away. And I hate to say this from other pack op- or from other pack drops. Right. At least moving forward until they lower a price, if they ever lower the price. Yeah. So I think from now on, just seeing this, I'm just going to focus on the marketplace and yeah. do some buying there. Yeah. But we took a chance, didn't pay it off, but. You know, it is what it is. Yep. This Free all we, day debut. So we, we knew that this was a gamble here. So, but that's okay. We yeah. got you up next and we'll see if you can pull something. Yeah. All right. So we knew that this was a gamble here. Obviously, if we don't see what we like, we're holding on to these moments. You know, I'm not going to, not going to be paying $49 selling these at the floor. So it looks like right. I got three commons right. as well. Let's get into door number one here. What do we got? Another Foster Moreau. Matthew Ioannidis. Never heard of him. Commanders. Oh, man. Putting Ooh. Derek Carr on the ground. Yeah. Good cereal, I, too. I mean, I, I feel like I know most football players, but uh, when it comes to uh, t- defense alignment. Yeah. I, you know, I don't know him very well. I know his name, but I, I mean, not really his game. I'll say this. You know, as much as I love that NFL all day is having defensive players. Let's not flood the ma- marketplace with defense alignment here, guys. I mean, good enough to give them their shine, but like, let's get sexy a little bit here. You know, it's, I mean, there's a handful of great D linemen. There are, there, though. there are, there are, there are, I'm not arguing that. All right, here we go. Come on. Three, two, eight, seven. Yep. There's another, uh, Kamuru, form. yeah, there's another, I literally looked this guy up. And saying, yep, there's a possibility yeah. I get him. Here's another $6 moment here. Yeah, I think he's at the floor. Yep. It'll be interesting to see, you know, how Top Shot, I mean, I see Top Shot used to do so many Top Shot videos, how Dapper and NFL All Day institute the utility to these to hopefully get the floor up at some point to these players where, you they know, these, these guys get put in the flash challenges. And, you know, hopefully I can see players like this end up, you know, Getting up in that floor a little bit more. All right, door number two. What do we got? Come on. Something good. Come on. Something good here. Oh, Nine, no. one, seven, eight. Kenny oh, Moore. no. I actually wanted to pick one of these up on the marketplace. I think he's going for like five, six bucks. Yeah. They're only I mean, 26. So uh, the uh, rare made moment. The Pro Bowl this year. Not living up to the hype here of the name. Yeah. And living the up to. shirt's not so lucky here. Yeah. Living up to the uh, our doormat names uh, yeah. of what we of what the we alter call ego. yeah the alter ego DFS is what we call ourselves doormats of the DFS yeah, community the perennial doormats yeah oh man well there you go guys I mean all in in, in positivity it's all Top Shot debuts which I can't complain about unfortunately all day debuts yeah sorry all day <laughs> debuts we need to have like a Top Shot yeah. jar <laughs> yeah. Every time uh, we say top shot, yeah. said all day, put a dollar in. Unfortunately, Cole and I pulled the uh, grossest packs that you could probably pull, and that was our fear. And uh, that's that's the gamble we all took. I mean, we we yep. had discussions on uh, with you guys in the comments section. We saw a few of you guys saying you guys were so weary of these packs, you weren't going to get into them because it just smelled like the standard and elite packs over on top shot. And this is exactly what it is right now. So the question going forward here. Uh, is what what Dapper is going to do? You know, is Dapper going to continue to just roll these forty nine dollar packs out for NFL all day, seeing that the floor is at five dollars, seeing that their customers are just losing money over and over and over, and all of these packs they're putting together, or are they going to do something about it and potentially lower the price to give us you know a little bit more opportunity? Now the problem with that is if they do lower the price, does that devalue the marketplace? Right? Does does that make some of these moments going for $30, $40? Does that make those moments come down? So yeah. all, all questions that we got to ask ourselves here. Cole, any, any, any last thoughts here before we get out of here? Uh, No, I think I'm good. Looking forward to buying some more moments on the marketplace yeah, now. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, I could have went and spent $18 on three of these moments and spent $49, but that's the chance we take. It's all good. We hope you guys had better luck than us out here. If you guys like these pack opening videos, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Twitter at the right moment when you're on to go find us on Spotify comment section. Let us know who you pulled, guys. Hopefully, you guys had better luck than us. We'll see you guys coming up with some more content soon. Good luck collecting out there, everybody. See you in the next one. Yeah.